Well, Paso Locomotive FC has been one of the best teams in the USL since its inception in 2019. But the architect behind all of the success is leaving the club. Locomotive FC announced on Monday that Lowry is leaving the team after three seasons. KTSM 9 Sports anchor Colin Deaver joins us with more. Christina Mark Lowry led El Paso to the playoffs all three years that he was here, creating a juggernaut in the process. But sources have confirmed that Lowry is leaving Locomotive to become the head coach and technical director of Indy 11. That is a club in the USL's Eastern Conference that has been very interested in hiring Lowry for the last few months after they parted ways with their previous manager. Now it's a decision that could be seen by some as a lateral move, but it does make sense for Lowry. Indy 11 are one of the most respected clubs in the league, though they've fallen on hard times recently. Ownership has Long wanted to try to make the jump to the MLS. If they do so, Lowry would get his shot at that level. Plus, if he's successful in Indianapolis, he'd also make himself even more attractive to clubs at higher levels of soccer, the MLS, or maybe even other leagues overseas. So while it was a tough decision to leave El Paso, this was the right one for Lowry at this time, not only for him, but for his family and his future. For me, it was always I wanted to do well in El Paso, and then MLS was the goal. That's, that's the objective for almost all USL coaches, and unfortunately, my phone's not ringing. Um, there's, there's seven or eight MLS jobs open right now. We've, we've inquired, uh, but no contact back, no interviews, nothing like that. So um, Indy 11's a market, and Indianapolis is a market where they've had that aspiration in the past, they've tried before. I know they're still ambitious to do that. And it's a market that can, that can um, cater to an MLS team and, and, and hold an MLS team. So that's all, that is in the back of my mind. Lowry said this move had nothing to do with money or anything Locomotive FC didn't do. He has nothing but love for the city and the club in El Paso. It's simply about his career goals. Simply put, do well in Indianapolis and the big boys could come calling. Coming up tonight at 6 p.m. on KTSM, we'll hear more from Lowry on his decision to move to Indy 11. We'll also speak with Andrew Forrest, the general manager of Locomotive FC, on where he hopes the club can go to hire their new coach. Of course, that's going to be happening very soon in the next coming days and weeks. From now, live in studio, Colin Deaver, KTSM 9 Sports.